Hey everyone, it's Pals of Poison here, and <laughs> welcome to See You Soon by Not Jacob, which is a horror game, experimental, I might add, uh, that you can find on itch.io using the link down below. Check it out for yourself if you want to support local does. I'm sure it wants me to do something, I just don't know what. <laughs> Ugh. So do I press something? Ugh. None of, the, none of the regular buttons seem to be doing anything. Oh god, who is it? At this time of night. Alright, I'm surely going to pick it up. I don't think so, man. Well, looks like I gotta go pick it up myself. Stupid mom. So lazy. I have a fish tank. Alright. How do I... Oh, oh, okay, I got it. Is this where I need to go? Is this where I need to go? No. Huh? Where is all the furniture? Hey, man. Hey, man. Dude. Dude, where's your furniture, dude? I don't know, dude. Hello? Oh, now they hung up, huh? Damn it. What a moron. Yeah, because that's what I would say. Hey, what's this? A CD? It's neat that his thoughts are have a different noise when the or sound or whatever you want to call it uh, when the text appears than his actual um, verbal speech. Press enter. Play it. Hmm. Well, gotta play it then. DVD player should be just below the TV. Yeah, I see that. If you're watching this, it means an emergency has occurred. Oh, Lord. Secure yourself in an enclosed room without windows and only one entrance. Do not respond to anyone outside. Is this a Mandela catalog thing? No matter how human they sound. Or analog horror. Do not come out to investigate strange sounds or lights. I'm doomed. Most importantly, have fun. Do not let him find you. Well, I would have been fine if you just left me alone. What? Why should I lock myself? What the hell's wrong? And what do they mean by him? From the Powerpuff Girls. I need to hide, quickly. Oh, I'm afraid it's too late for that. Oh, oh my god. Oh no. It's him. Uh, yep, yep, bye. Run. I, yes, running. Oh, what a horrible noise is. This is not happening. Stop. You have to stop to have that thought? <laughs> what did he do to my family? We go, go that way, I guess. No, I can't. It's only 2D side-scrolling. What, what did he do to everything? I gotta turn it down. It's like... Sound effects took over. All right, let's go. I guess he didn't catch up to us. It seems the time for us to face each other has come. Mortal Kombat. Oh, enter. Our dude kind of looks like a Buckeye with the, you know, split part on the bottom. Oh, I need to do something? Okay. I have been looking forward to meeting you. And then eating you. <laughs> Before we begin though, let us take care of those irre irrelevant to our little chat. Is that me, player? What? Oh. He was talking to us. 
No, greetings. That's not my name. Let us begin. Listen carefully. Okay. I need you. Oh, that's sweet. I need your body. <laughs> I, I just meant you, evil computer entity. I, oh my God. Okay. Oh, real quick. Come on. I need a vessel. Oh, okay. So you don't want to... All right. No, 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 no. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. This world, the one I reside in, I am well aware it's not real. Anything done here is meaningless. My purpose is to slaughter. I crave infliction of pain, suffering, and death. Genocide of mere virtual human imitations fulfills this craving only to some extent. I want more. I want real impact. Real terror. Real death. Do you understand why you're so crucial? Let me think about it. Let me take over your body. Okay. Very well. Just what was expected from you. I am not disappointed. Now listen carefully. I shall provide you with instructions. Enter the building at... Oh my god, are these like legit coordinates? I don't have a pen! Okay. Poppers. That's what I'm calling you. Palace of Poison. P.O.P. Pop. Poppers. Do you hate it? Uh, okay. Anyway, if anybody's interested, check out those coordinates. 39... Negative 76. Man, and me without a pen. I'm such a schlub. Alright, let's just keep going. I'll go back and check it later. Do not look around. Do not hesitate. Inside, you might experience hallucinations. You might hear people talking to you. You might feel things grasp your hands. You know what? It's bothering me. I have to look it up. I have to look it up. And so it's like 39 degrees something. And what was it? Negative 76? Point like 7 degrees? What? <laughs> the coordinates. Coordinates? Nates. Yes, yes, show me that. Show, show me, show me that. Uh, find or enter latitude and longitude. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Oh, you can do that in Google Maps? No kidding? I'm such a dumb. Okay, uh. Google Maps. We're gonna figure this out together. Oh, okay, here it is. Uh, coordinates 39 degrees. Can't. Uh, is it 39 degrees north or south or I really I don't know how how these work. I never seen. Oh, I can't find that either. Although there's a Walmart Supercenter right there. I'm gonna try putting in 30 degree that degrees north and see if that helps. What? Fuck! Oh, this is gonna drive me nuts! West. How do you put in freaking coordinates? Okay, so I actually went back and replayed up to this point again so I get those specific numbers uh, for the coordinates and what I found is that it is some kind of dilapidated looking building big old building in Maryland um, with a 
circle drive. It looks like it could have been a school or something, you know, or maybe, uh, I don't know, some kind of government building. Uh, but it is super dilapidated looking. Uh, so, you know, if you want. Here, maybe I can, uh, maybe I can uh, display, capture, ah, not that. Other window. Why am I on game capture? Thank you. Yeah, all right. So let me move this. So yeah, you can see there, that's it in the in the upper middle. Uh, that's the coordinates. So you can see it's really just kind of cruddy looking. Um, yeah, it looks like at one time it might have been nice. But yeah, so now it's just a dilapidated looking uh, building. So yeah, there's that. All right, we're going to go back to the actual game. I'm going to turn off display capture and move this window back over here. And okay, we're back in. We're back at it. Inside, you might experience hallucinations. You might hear people talking to you. You might feel things grasp your hands. You might see unimaginable horrors before your eyes. Do not fret. These are mere hallucinations. Nothing more. Inside, everything is ready, waiting for you. I'll take care of everything else. See you soon. Palace of Poison. And then it just ends. Blech. Okay. I'm not going there. Unless you pay for it. And I want expenses. I want an expense account. Also, uh, my regular rate for what I would be getting paid. If I was working. My regular job. And then, and then maybe I'll go there. You know. And I don't want to fly in an airplane. I just don't like them. So I'll go by train. All right. Or, you know, I'll drive, but you have to reimburse me the gas up front. Um, so, yeah. At a reasonable rate. Something cents per mile, whatever. Um, yeah. Anyway, so that was actually pretty cool. Uh, I like how in the beginning it was this 2D side scrolling thing, which that in and of itself could have been like, you know, if there, if there was more of that, that could have been a really cool game too, because it had a creature, it was scary, there was, you know, good sound design. Love that good sound design always. Um, but then, super freaking awesome twist there at the end. Well, I guess the middle, where we find out that it's actually talking to us, the player, and he popped his head. That was. A pretty sweet moment. I really enjoyed this. Yeah, I just wish there was more of it. Uh, I'm sure there's other dialogue that occurs and some other things that happen if you were to say no to his question. Uh, I'm not going to go back and do it because I had to go through the game like several times. One of the times I was at AFK and like the monster that appears like grabbed me and I died like a freaking idiot. Um, but anyway, uh, I eventually got there, but I didn't want to play through it again, you know, just to just to say no to him and have a few more dialogue options. So I urge you, if you are interested, to support the dev by checking out the game for yourself using that link down below. If you like the video, go ahead and click that like button. If you, if you like how I don't know how to work coordinates, click the like button. Uh, if you haven't done so already, I'd be also grateful if you were to subscribe, and I thank you. I think that's going to do it for this video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.